Cambridge. IGCSE. O Level Biology. 0660. 0970 Syllabus. Chapter 1. Characteristics and Classification of Living Organisms. 1.4. Plant Kingdom. Prepared by. Dr. Adele Gerges. Plant Kingdom. Characteristics of Plant. They are multicellular organisms with specialized tissues like xylem, phloem, and epidermis. They have cell wall made of cellulose. They are able to absorb and convert light energy into chemical energy by photosynthesis process to form glucose by using chlorophyll and other pigments. 6 carbon dioxide plus 6 water molecule in presence of light energy and chlorophyll gives out glucose molecule C6H12O6 plus oxygen. The plant can make its own food so it is considered the producer of food in most food chains. Classification of Plant Kingdom The plant kingdom divided into four groups. Number 1 algae which are Green algae Brown algae And red algae Number 2 mosses Number 3 ferns Number 4 seed plants which subdivided into two types Type 1 conifers Type 2 flowering plants Number 1 algae, which are multicellular with differentiated tissues that mean specialized tissues doing different jobs. Small simple plants. Live near waterfalls, fountains and wells. Reproduce by spores. Number 3 ferns. Characteristics. Plants with roots, stems and leaves. Contain vascular tissues, xylem and phloem, for transport and support. Leaves are called fronds. Don't produce flowers. Reproduce by spores. Number 4 Seed Plants They are subdivided into two main types. Type 1 Conifers, they form seeds inside cones. Type 2 Flowering Plants They form seeds inside fruit. Fruit is formed from development of ovary of the flower. Seeds are formed from development of ovules that equal eggs inside the ovary. Flowering plants are subdivided into two main divisions. Monocotyledons and dicotyledons. Both have roots, stems and leaves. They contain vascular tissues for transport and support. They produce flowers, fruits and seeds inside. For comparisons between monocot and dicot. Number 1 Cotyledon. Monocot. The seed is formed from one part called cotyledon. Like maize, date, rice and wheat grains. While dicot. The seed is formed from two cotyledons like beans and peas. Number 2 Roots Monocot Has fibrous roots like onion. While dicot Has a tap root like carrot. Number 3 Vascular Bundle and Stems Monocot Has a scattered vascular bundles which contain xylem and phloem. While dicot Has a well-arranged vascular bundles in a ring. Number 4 Leaves In monocot plants are narrow with parallel veins or venation, while in dicot plants the leaves are broad with network or branched venation. Number 5 Flowers In monocot plants the floral parts like petals lie in threes or its multiples, while in dicot plants the floral parts lie in four or five and its multiples. The diagram shows some leaves and flowers of different plants. Which are from monocotyledons? Letter A1 and 3. Letter B1 and 5. Letter C2 and 4. Letter D2 and 5. The answer is B. Where 1 is a narrow leaf with parallel venation and 5 is a flower with 6 petals equal multiple of 3. What are the features of the leaves of a plant that is a eudicotyledon or dicotyledon? The dicotyledons are plants with broad leaves so the answer either A or B. Also the dicotyledonous leaves with branched veins not parallel. So the answer is B. The statements describe four different plants. Which plant must be a monocotyledon? Letter A the flowers are wind pollinated. Letter B the flowers each have five petals. Letter C the leaves are large with a clear network of veins on them. Letter D. The leaves have parallel veins. The answer is D, where monocot has leaves with parallel veins. Thank you for watching.